Hello, salam alaikum, beautiful people. Welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Marie. This will be episode four. Sorry we didn't bring one last week, but it was our anniversary and I had something planned for my wife. Due to loving her so much, I had to do something special for her. Anyway, before we start, I just want to say you are our inspiration. You help us create these you help us keep going. We love seeing people watching the videos. We love and would love to hear comments from you. We would love more subscribers. If you know anyone that would be interested in our content, please let them know. Don't forget to hit subscribe and the notification button and leave us a comment. Please, please, please. We'd love to hear from you. Anyway, before we uh, start, I'd like to ask some of our Gambian viewers and the beautiful people in Gambia. They're so friendly and kind. Everyone should visit there, in my opinion. But I'd like to ask if you know anywhere we can get a tripod for her iPhone so that she can record better quality videos for us to watch without having to hold on to it and try and do all the cooking and everything else she does. Also, um, it would help when she's making longer videos. Like today, one, today's one is longer. She tried to add more stuff for you guys, like the preparation and everything else. So I hope you really appreciate and enjoy it and she'd love to hear from you. Don't forget, she would love your comments and um, you inspire us, you help us create these, you keep us going, you all have the power within you to be beautiful people and you are beautiful people, you all have the power within you to live a great life and be in a great position in life. Nobody in this life should be struggling or anything like that, there's enough to go around in this universe we just have to see it and we have to claim it. So until next time, Jerry Jeff, thank you for watching. Peace out. We love you all. If you want to watch some of our older videos, they'll be in the description below. Just click the link and it'll take you right to them. Thank you all. Love you. Welcome to another episode of Cooking with Marie. Today I'll be cooking a Gambian dish called Chuyaba. So let's get to the ingredients. Here we have olive oil. Like always, I love cooking with olive oil. I once had high cholesterol and the doctor advised me to be cooking with olive oil because it has no cholesterol. In here we have the fresh tomato and fresh pepper, black pepper, salt, tomato paste. We have the steak in here. And in this bowl here, I have four onions, cassava, carrots, and cabbage. If you are cooking for more than two people, because today I'm cooking for two people, that's why I'm using four onions. But if you are cooking for more than two, you can use more onions, because two requires a lot of onion. What I'm going to do first is to steam the steak. Let's put in some salt. Maggi cube. Now let's put the steak in the pot. The kitchen to steam it. While steaming the steak, let's go and cut the onions. So right now we're gonna cut the onions. I'm so glad that my husband showed me this method, having to put the onions first in the freezer so that 
it will reduce the gas. I'm done cutting the onions now. Let's move to the next. Next step is to pound the black pepper and the fresh pepper. I'm going to wash the fresh tomatoes and reduce the seed, then pound it separately. the onion and here is the pounded fresh tomato and check the steak now steak is now steamed so let's take it from Leave it for a few minutes to get hot and fry the steak. The steak is now fried. What I need to do next is to fry the onions. I'll leave it to fry for a few minutes before adding the fresh tomato. Add the fresh tomato. Just leave it to simmer for a while and add tomato paste. Now let's add the tomato paste. So what I will do, I'll leave it for two minutes to fry. Then we'll take it from there. Now I'm going to add a little bit of water. Put in the steak.
need to put in now the cabbage. Need some magic cube. More water. If you notice, I put the water in the pot that I used to steam the steak so that I can collect all that yummy goodness that was remaining in the pot. So now put in some water. This is to put in some salt. And then cover it to let it simmer. Rice right, waiting for this two to get steamer. Let's put some rice. Let's check this stew to see if it's steamer now. Wow, it's now cooked. Oh my god, look at that yummy goodness. Lunch will be served soon. Lunch is now served. Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. I'll see you next week.